We thought he was here to ask Torg to declare independence. By the time we realized Ulfric was here to challenge Torg, it was already too late. Why? By Nord custom, once the challenge was issued in court, Torg had no choice but to accept. Had he not, Ulfric would have had cause to call a new moot and a new vote for High King. Torg had some martial training, of course, but it mattered little that day. When Ulfric's lips parted, when he unleashed the power of the Thum, that shout, that ancient and terrible tongue, ripped Torg asunder. Ouch. That's not nice. Um, what's your problem? Nothing. I'm busy, and I don't like being bothered unless I'm expecting something from you. Oh, yeah, don't give fine. me that look. Fine, I suppose I can find some menial task to set your mind on. Hmm. We have something of a vampire problem. Vampire? Blood drained. I know of a den nearby you can wipe out as a precaution. I see what I, I can do. I don't expect you to be capable of even that. Vampires are clever hunters. More clever than you, definitely. Um, where is he? Where's your king? Hello, where is he? Anyways, disenchanting. I have nothing to enchant or disenchant. I need to do this. It saves a lot of mana and it makes my spells more, more effective and all that. Get out of the way, Lydia. That wasn't me, that was the game's noise. Just so you know. And that wasn't me neither. Nope. The game is making strange body noises. So, can I... no, there's a stealing... it's okay, it's okay. So, I got a few new spots to investigate. A vampire problem, uh, a boat, a lighthouse, and... Oh, it sure is busy around here. I've seen the court, I've seen the Bard's College. I couldn't really talk to the king here, but that's okay, that's okay. Oh, I can run, that's great. Ah shit, a little bit too long. I'm curious about this door now. Yeah, I avoided the temple, but now it's the only place left to go, so let's see. Blessings of the Eight Divines upon you. How may I... You look troubled. Have you come seeking guidance? What do the shrines do? Those who worship at the shrines will sometimes receive boons from the gods themselves. The nature of the favors varies per deity. Please, feel free to worship at any or all of the shrines. Okay. What's the white gold call? Concordat. It's the peace treaty that ended the war with the elves of the Almeri Dominion. The Dominion recognized the heresy of proclaiming Talos a god. Talos was a great man and a great emperor, but that does not make him a god. No matter how much the Stormcloaks may wish it were so. One of the alcoves up front is empty. Ah, hmm? oh, yes. That once held a shrine to Talos. But the worship of Talos was banned by the White Gold Concordat some time ago. What's that? It's the peace treaty that ended the war with the elves of the Almeri Dominion. 
The Dominium recognized the heresy of proclaiming Talos a god. Talos was a great man and a great emperor, but that does not make him a god. Okay, so he was a god. Yeah, uh, an so kind of. That was outside. Let's see. Sure sounds nice. So what do we have here? Shrine of Mara. What are you? Blessings to you. The divines are listening. You got a strange fetish going on there. Oh God! I, I just wanna look at this funny statues. Mawa, Julianos, Aktos, Gibiela, Kinames, Empty, Santa, okay, a 